Whether you're online doing a lot of video calls or live streams, or even just browsing and playing games, you deserve to have the best experience, which is why Speedify has different bonding modes available to ensure that you get the most out of your internet connections, no matter what you're doing. But first, what is Speedify's bonding mode setting? The bonding mode setting in Speedify decides how your connections are used, whether they're being actively bonded together, used redundantly, or both. You may want to adjust the setting depending on what you're using Speedify for. So let me show you how it works. First, make sure you've downloaded and installed Speedify. If you don't have it yet, head over to speedify.com slash download. The app is available for all platforms, Mac, Windows, Android, iOS, even Linux. Once you have the app installed, run Speedify and connect to a server with the toggle in the top right corner. To choose your preferred bonding mode, head into the settings menu by clicking the hamburger icon up top left of the app. Scroll down to the session settings and you'll see bonding mode, click it. Under bonding mode, you'll see two options and a toggle, speed mode, redundant mode, and a toggle for enhanced streaming. In speed mode, Speedify intelligently distributes your web traffic among all your available internet connections in order to deliver optimal speed and performance. We recommend this mode if maximizing your connection speeds is your priority. And if you're not sure, this is the mode to use. In redundant mode, Speedify will operate at the speed of the fastest single internet connection and use additional data on the other connections in order to deliver an ultra-reliable connection. When using redundant mode, each packet gets sent simultaneously over multiple connections. Whichever packet gets through first is the one to be delivered. Please note that this mode uses more data and therefore more battery. So most users are better off with speed mode. You like this video so far? Subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and Speedify how-tos. As you can see, our recommended settings are speed mode with enhanced streaming enabled. We call this speed plus. We use this combination of settings by default to maximize the speed and reliability of your streaming track, video calls, audio calls, live streaming, by intelligently using both bonding and redundant traffic to get the best performance from your available internet connections. With this setting enabled, Speedify will recognize anything that looks like a stream will prioritize that traffic over any other traffic and will intelligently switch between active bonding and redundancy depending on what your connects need. In this mode, Speedify can decide to use extra data and bandwidth in order to save your high priority calls and streams, but they're important stuff and that's probably what you want. That's it. Well, we recommend sticking with the recommended setting of Speed Plus for your bonding mode because it offers a great balance between speed, reliability, and data use. If you know that your time online will require something specific or you've already been advised by our support team to try different bonding modes, you're free to manually switch your bonding mode at any time. Now that you understand how bonding modes work, check out our other video about transport modes because we explain how you choose the protocol that gives you the best online experience.